It's a fine collection of rocks. Hey, Randy, what you got here? Hey, Noah. Hey. I, uh, you told me today at the range we were going to be reviewing the rock. So I printed out some of my favorite rock memes. We got, uh, Dwayne the Rock Swanson here. <laughs> That's amazing. That's get, amazing. I mean, you got the... That's really good. Yeah. yeah. You got the classic... Okay, yeah, no, I know that 90s one. 90s photo. Yeah, 90s rock. Got some other nice ones. You got the... Can you do one of those? That. No, I can't. The smolder? Yeah, I don't know. It's hard to do with glasses on. And then just some other rocks. Uh... I thought we meant these rocks. I thought you meant the rock. I don't think that's what either one of us meant. What did you mean then? You said you were bringing a rock. Yeah, hang on. Okay. Oh. No, the rock! No, all my rocks! Oh! Palmetto! The rock. It is literally called the Palmetto 5-7 rock. Yeah. So when you said we were shooting the rock today... Yeah, I meant Palmetto's rock. Then why did you bring, like, rocks? I you... like rocks. That's fair. I just like rocks. So what do you got? Oh, I've, I've got the rock. We should, uh, you know... Wow. I guess we we'll take a pretty look. That's nice. Yeah. It's, um... It's their copy of the, uh, I'm assuming they're copying the Ruger 5.7. That makes sense. Right, because it shoots 5.7 by 28. Yeah. Which, um, I've gotten to shoot this gun, and I love it, personally. Okay. It's probably one of my new favorite pistols that what? we've shot. Yeah. What? Uh, you know, it, and it, it just comes down to simply the 23 rounds that you get. In the mag? In the mag. Good at night. At one time. Look at this chonkity boy. Yeah, look how many, I mean, it's double stacked all the way down. Wow. I mean, it just, it, it's fun because it's like shooting a rifle with the amount of ammo that you can put in there. Yeah. and But I you don't have that like extendo mag annoyance. That's true. Yeah. But you mentioned ammo. I think that's the most unique thing about this gun. Yeah, we should, um, yeah, let's grab one out of the mag real quick here. Maybe. Ah, there we go. I got it. That is the 5.7 by... 28. 28. Yeah. It's, it's, um, let me get a little... You're not allowed to step in front of the table. The I've universe broken a cardinal roll. But uh, it's it's literally like a small two two three. Is it's what it looks so like. So small. It looks like just a two two three, but someone, honey, I shrunk the kids did. But a handgun shoots it. Yeah. No. Yeah. Definitely. It's um. I believe, and we should probably Google or you could check me. Uh, I think P90 shoot this. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. I, I think the question people are asking themselves is like, what do I buy this for? Like, am I gonna carry this every day? Like, as a, you know, <laughs> I mean, personally, I would. Twenty three rounds, but is it as effective ballistically as say a nine millimeter of forty five? Um, I would imagine so. I think maybe after we I see... know it's definitely known for going through soft uh, armor. Yeah, and that's the thing. I, I, I'm probably wrong, but FN was who made the original. Yeah, P90. yeah, FN. And yeah. I think they made this ammo for that gun. They yeah. were, like, made at the same time. And I believe the purpose of this ammo, especially the armor-piercing ones, is so that, like, Secret Service members and, like, government agents of, of their country could carry a full auto or select fire uh, P90 with armor-piercing rounds in it. Right. That's and, yeah. kind of what these are known for. People are, like, the 5.7. It is. It definitely right is. Right through body armor. You know? And um, we've wanted one since. I mean, for, I've wanted one forever. I know my dad has. I'm sure you have. Yeah. And the price has just kind of been out of my reach. On a P90? <laughs> Definitely a P90, but even like the FN57 or the yeah, Ruger like that came out with one, it's, I've spent that kind of money on guns, but I don't really want to spend that on a pistol that I don't know enough about. Right. Especially a brand new one. Right. From a company who just started making them. Yeah. So for 319, I was like, how, you know, and my dad was in the same boat. He actually, he messaged me right before, as he was, he was like, should I buy it? As he had already bought it. Of course. You know, but he was like, I was like, how could we not for that? So. And I think it's important to know anytime you ask yourself, should I buy, and then it's a gun afterwards, the answer's already yes. Yeah. Unless. Unless what? I can't think of a good reason. Well, let's shoot this thing and see well, what the heck it is. It, it go bang. All right, we'll see. Let's go. I'll take, I'm not taking your word for it, though. You okay? The rock's just everywhere. They say, y'all got any good bits? I said, all of our bits are good. <laughs> It's cold out here!
It's funny because a lot of the times it's hot. Yeah. <laughs> and this time it's cold. Yeah, don't really we're complaining about how hot it is. Okay, so uh, I think we're both gonna take ten shots at the uh, dual entry down here, and you know, kind of get a judge for the gun. Um, we definitely haven't shot it today, so it'll be a fresh, new experience. Ready? Ready. You, get, you guys ready? Have you uh, hit the comment or liked or subscribed? Hit the bell. I can't start until you do. I'm listening. I think I heard it. Okay, we're good. <clears throat> All right, let's see what we can do here. Hopefully we don't do terrible. All right, come on now. It's a little over. There we go. I haven't counted. That was nine. I forgot to count. You counted? Yeah. Good job. Thank you. And yes. That was a good. Hey, you know, I hit most of them. Yeah. I did all right. I'm not, this is new to for most of this. I have shot it a little bit, but I am new to it. Okay. Um, so I'll say you throw 10 at that, and then we have some bigger targets down range we can try too for fun. True. All right, here you go. Mm -hmm. let's, let's see what you Let's see. Let's see, let's see. I think you're shooting high. That's what really? it looks like. Yeah. What a strange gun. You know, it does that, apparently. You hit the stand. I did. Do I have one more in here? Yeah. Okay. There you go. Huh. There, you go. there you go. You started to figure it out. Yeah, I guess so. <clears throat> I think it just takes a second to kind of get used to it. Does it? It seems like it shoots a little high. Is that me? No, I think you're right. You want to yeah. try that really far away one? Sure. Well, there's two down there. We'll try both. Oh, right? gosh. Let's it's, load up. It is a rifle caliber. Right. So we did such a terrible job at hitting the thing that was really close to us, we figured we'd try further. Makes sense. Yeah. So uh, let's see what happens here. I'm going to try this slightly closer one first. There it is. Four. Okay. All right. We'll go to the other one. Wow. I got one. It was good. Yeah, I mean, for a pistol. Yeah. I'm not really expecting to shoot pistols that far. So. Right. Let's see what Randy can do. <laughs> Looked a little left. No idea. Probably high then. There you go. All right. I did it in three. Let's try the far one. That is hard to see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I hit it! Look at you, you marksman! <laughs> so I got uh, two on the close one, one on the far one. And, uh... But I mean, you have 23 rounds, so... <laughs> you'll hit it! Yeah, you'll get there eventually. Let's see how it does on paper. I think we should check the paper. So we're doing some paper accuracy testing. Paper accuracy. Have we With done that With the before? rock. Uh, no, first time on the channel. All right, cool. So I guess I'll shoot both targets. Yeah, whatever you want. Maybe just one. Just one? Yeah. Okay, well, I got I got 20 rounds. So, all 20? No. No? Maybe like five or six. Five? Okay. Six? I like six, so I'll do seven. All right. And then probably do six. Okay. All right. We're professionals. I'm not. Eight? So that was seven. Okay. That's good though. Hey, you wanna see what you can do? Yeah. Alright.
That was six. Yeah, sounded like it. Yeah, let's go. I guess take a look. This okay. doesn't have a safety on it. I'm not going to put it in my... <laughs> okay. No, you didn't really... That's kind of... Is that bad? Well, you didn't hit the target. I wasn't aiming at the target. I aimed at this target. Oh, silly me. Yeah, the whole thing. Silly me. Yeah. Um... You did far better. I'd than like I did. to talk about that. That's pretty decent. You did pretty good, actually. I think that's okay. Okay. Let's make sure they can see it. I hit these right here. You did, yeah. I hit those. Yeah, yeah. And then you over here, you hit over here. I did. Um, something about me. I know I always shoot left. That's a problem of mine. I've always had. Yeah. So, that's what I did. Uh, yeah, I always shoot a little left. So I could have compensated for that, and I didn't. It's okay. Um, but my grouping was pretty spread out as well. I didn't really give it, uh, I didn't take my time. I was kind of in it. It's okay. But I really like shooting it. I yeah. just, like, I have so much fun. I'm just like, <laughs> I keep pulling. What do you think it'll do to some fruit? <sighs> it's either going to be really cool or just go right through and do nothing. Let's find out. Let's find out. <laughs> what? What? I'm excited to shoot the fruit. The what? The fruit. <laughs> I'm excited to shoot it. Hey, you know, um. I think we should talk about something. What? We're getting close to a thousand. We are. We're gonna need t-shirts. Merch. Merch. Yep. So hopefully everybody wants merch. Let us know in the comments like what merch you would wear. I'm I really had this fruit shooting boogie idea in my yeah, head like for a long time. Yeah, I like the fruit shooting boogie. Yeah. I like fruit shooting boogie a lot. But let us know. And if you guys are artists out there and you want to collab with us and come up with some cool artwork for our merch, Ooh. we would love to uh, partner with love you. To, yeah, and just see what you got for sure. Yeah. All right. All right. Well, thank you. Let's, what? uh, what? what were you about to say? Nothing. Oh, okay. You want to see some fruit? I think that's what they're here for. Some fruit. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> okay. 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 <laughs> you good, buddy? It's unusual, but, uh, we're gonna, <laughs> it's unusual. We're going to pretend that didn't happen. That was kind of nice. Oh, yeah, sorry. I think it's just going straight through it. Yeah, we'll put it back up. Okay, I just wanted to check. All right, well, I mean, we've got 23, so we can, okay. we can play around a little bit. Okay. Boom! Mm. That was nice. Okay. All right. That'll leave four for you. All you right. Know. Let's see what Randy can do. I missed. You did, right? Right through it. Whoa! 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 Oh, I was hoping he wouldn't fall. What a pound? You're just really nicking it. <laughs> that thing is sturdy. That is what? shoot a little to the right. I think I'm hitting it. Whoa, you are. I mean, you're nailing it. It's just too easy to go anywhere. Shoot that pi that pineapple deserves more. Keep going. Let's get away with this. It's getting. Crazy. I think we need to go look at what just happened. What, what's up with this pine? Did you staple it? No. So you can see the pineapple. There's a couple little holes, but let's look at the. Whoa! <laughs> what a sturdy pineapple. Wow. That like you look at the front and it just looks normal. Yeah. And it's almost. Like, oh, there it is. That shows you the ballistics of the five seven, right? That's there. right. I mean, this guy got it pretty good. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, that watermelon's not having a great time. Yeah. That honeydew almost looks perfect, though. Yeah, we can definitely... Oh, my gosh. Once again, hey, uh, when we, you, you got it? There we go. Right. Okay, there we go. Let's there take we go. a look at it real quick. The ballistics on that, That's though. an entry, I think. That's definitely an entry. And then the X. <laughs> wow. I think that deserves another go. That does deserve another go. Wow, look at this one. Almost, almost invisible entry hole. I think that deserves another go. All right, all right. Ew, first of all. Yeah, it gets sticky. This guy. Just oh the back end again. Hey, look, we have a perfectly good, no, we don't. Yeah, no, it, where did it go in? 
right there? No, no that's, that's just a soft dent. spot. Oh, let me back up. That's a good question. I have no idea. Maybe we just hit the side and it blew up. I think up I hit it side. twice, so it could have spun it. Yeah. But I think really you should just. There's take one more it. pineapple down there. There's actually two good pineapples down there. Are there? I mean, there's, <laughs> you got, there's a whole flat side now. There's again. You can kind of see the ballistics entry. Yeah. Exit. Wow. Pineapples, you know, not very fun to look at. Show cool ballistics though. And I think we talked about whether you would want to use this gun for like you know self defense. I, ugh, I can't really argue with you after that. No. It's definitely a. <laughs> Makes it look like you're fine, and then you're really not. You're really not. Yeah. I think, though, since it's your gun, I think you should just kind of take us through the ham? rest of it. Okay, well, let's do that. All right. So, uh, fruit shoot buggy? Yeah. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Man, that pineapple really just shows the ballistics, I feel like. The rounds are moving so fast. They're going right through and blowing out the back. You yep. can see the like the shatter out of the back. Oh. Yeah. Yep. Oh yeah, I mean just completely the backside's gone. Ta-da! The back got blew out. And then I think the watermelon and the honeydew speak for themselves. Yeah, they're a little bit more dense, I think. With yeah, water. I, think, I think the water explodes. Yep. Didn't like to compress, so. Um yeah, you know, we've shot pineapple in the past, and I never really liked shooting it because it doesn't do anything. It doesn't. That's the first time I have seen the water, the pineapple look fine in the front and then just completely gone in the back. And that was really cool. That I like cool. that. That showed really cool ballistics there. Um, maybe one day we'll have the budget for slow-mo and jail, but for now we got fruit. And I think we should go talk about the 5.7 Rock. Okay. The PSA 5.7 Rock is not in here anymore, but... No, it's right there. Where? Right, right, right there. Oh! <laughs> there it is! Yeah! The PSA 5.7 Rock by Palmetto State Armory in West Columbia, South Carolina. Chambered in 5.7 by 28. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'll be honest with you. I want your judgment, because I'm... I'm, I feel like my judgment is incorrect. At first, <clears throat> I didn't really care for it. Okay. It was kind of inaccurate for me. Yeah, that yeah. Probably a lot me. Yeah, I, I feel like we can, me and you have a hard time judging accuracy. True, true, true. That's why we're out here. That's, <laughs> that's, why we're that's right, we practice. But uh, what it did to the fruit. Really changed your mind, huh? It did, it did. I yeah. think this is a viable weapon, especially with the 20 rounds. 23 round capacity We mag. did have a little trouble when we put 23 in it. That's true. It didn't like that. You think it's a new mag thing or? Maybe. Uh, maybe new mag with some oil is what it needs, you know? Possibly. And, um, but it didn't seem to like the full 23, but 20, it never, it never even nope. slowed down. So even if you're only putting 20 in it. I like it. I don't, yeah. let me real quick. Okay, well, I'll let you real quick. Sure, it's not bad. It's nothing to write home about. No, it's not a fancy knife trigger like a like a it, like that dagger you had, which has got a really nice trigger yeah. in my opinion for yeah. being out of the box. Yep. This isn't like that, but it's not bad at all. And it's I'm noticing a, a lot of similarities between the dagger and this. I'm sure a lot of the same machines made the same guns. Oh, I'm but sure. Very similar grip. Which is a nice grip. It is. It yeah. is. It's nice and tall. Yeah. Fits great in the hand. It does. You know? I like it. It gets a 5.7 out of 5.7 for me. Yeah, I'm going to give it a 7.62 out of 39. That's a good score for you. Yeah. So, well, now what? Go get one. Right now? Yeah. All right. Go get one. You, you'll be here when I get back? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. It's going to take me a while. No, I'll be here. All I don't right. have to go work till like, Wednesday. Keep, the Rock will be here to keep you company, okay? I like rocks. All right. So anyway, while he's gone, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, tell your grandma, your uncle, your grandpa, you know, everybody, aunt, uncle. I said uncle twice. So tell two of your uncles. And uh, don't forget to hit the bell, and we'll see you next time at Clippazine HQ. So, uh...
I guess we should review the rock memes. Okay. I think Dwayne the Rock Swanson is probably my favorite. It's just a flawless Photoshop job. It is. Okay, look. It is a flawless Photoshop. But if I had to pick one, I'm a personal fan of the 90s rock. I know. I, I think we should probably get those fits. Oh, we should have got those fits for the video. We messed that up a little. Yep. Uh, I think he just looks like a really nice guy in this one. Yeah, he does look really happy there. He does. Shows his age a little bit, though. Yeah, yeah. He, you know, when you heroes are getting old, I mean, I never watched yeah. The Rock. Uh, this one's kind of unique. Um, it's just The Rock holding the Mountain Dew. I think it's like a Geo dude. I feel like he's not the kind of guy that drinks Mountain Dew. It's like he's, um, yeah, I don't like this one. This one does not spark joy. No, it sparks anguish. Anxiety. Yeah. But let's just do the gun then. That we makes more sense. We should just do the gun. All right. Okay, that's what they're here for. Cool.